What's up, everybody? We back with another message, another video. Thank you to all my new subscribers and future new subscribers. You know we do nothing here without God because everything is spiritually led by God over here. We cover the world from a spiritual and physical aspect to get the raw, real, and uncut answers. So anything you hear, anything you see in these end times, may you test the spirits, a.k.a. take the words and visuals back to prayer with God, as there are many Decepticons running around in these end times sent from the enemy, had a strong, close, and personal relationship with God. Good, great, and awesome. All right, everybody, August 24th, 2024, on a good old Saturday word here. Real quick that the Lord had given me. So let's get into it. This is what the Lord had to say. For I want you to notice something. When it comes to the words of blessings and financial freedom, many ears are opened. When it comes to my knowledge and wisdom being passed on from one servant to the other, many ears turn away. Many of you wonder why so many are deceived. That is the answer to your question. Many want the result instead of the knowledge and wisdom that come with it. I am only gifts to many. My servants in the past received knowledge and wisdom in order to fulfill their purpose. Many today receive knowledge and wisdom from men who have not received godly wisdom from me, but of the world, but of their own understanding, but of their own interpretation. So how could the learners of those men who didn't even seek me teach you the ways of your father? It is the effort you have put into your relationship with me that will help determine the outcome of a blessing. Do not confuse the watchman of blessings with the watchman of your father. I thought this was pretty father-like because just the way he's saying that. It is one thing to watch gold become more valuable. It is another to watch over the people who will be affected when gold becomes more valuable. So simple explanation to what it means when the Lord is saying watching over the people who will be affected when gold does become more valuable. This is basically the people in the body of Christ that are not listening to the Lord and valuing the blessing over him. So the blessing is louder than him. Therefore, ignoring all of his warnings will result in people also being affected just like the world will be affected. So he's trying to look out for them so that that doesn't have to happen to them. But they're more so listening to the watchmen of the blessing itself than the people who are trying to give the knowledge and the wisdom from the Lord as well, if that makes sense. But yeah, ladies and gentlemen, make sure you keep your eyes on God, solely on the Lord. And he will give you everything you need in understanding, knowledge, wisdom. He will take care of everything and give you the plan on how to do things and what to do. You just got to have patience and endurance and stop trying to find your own way to do things and stop letting your flesh speak louder than your spirit when it comes to finances. Because that's how a lot of people getting into heaps of trouble with deception right now. Peace and blessings and I'll catch y'all in the next one.